Phillips has shown us the way to become not only neuroscience partners, research partners, but business partners by offering a, a scientific team that allows our researchers to develop in tandem with Philips. The ability to enhance throughput, the ability to change the exam experience for patients, the ability to cope with today's uh, financial environment. I think those are all innovations that I see. I would say Philips is leading in patient experience, especially in the pediatric world. We do have a couple of 3D magnets in our pediatric hospital where they have invested in uh, technologies which help the children get through their magnet or the scans faster. As clinicians, we know what these individuals go through. To have Philips offer a experience that is far user, more user friendly, I think that's gonna also help uh, the, uh, the uh, amount of patients we'll be able to do per day. It is really important to get these MR imaging correctly the first time. Um, if you have patients who are challenged by sitting still in the magnet, you need to have other tools at your disposal so that you can image more rapidly, have motion corrections, you can extract useful information. Uh, those things, I think, are, are, are well developed as technologies which make a big difference. I would credit Philips with leading the way in parallel imaging and the utilization of sense technologies uh, a decade ago, and now moving forward with many of their research collaborations in terms of fast scanning and motion corrected imaging. I want images that are motion free, that look great in every case, because it helps me make a diagnosis. I've seen really innovative work come out of Philips in terms of angiography and, and vessel tagging and helping us to stand, understand the dynamics of vascular supply to the diseased brain. I think that they really do listen about ways in which to improve how we work daily. So trying to develop more useful tools at the workstation which really improve our workflow that are cutting edge but at the same time really geared to uh, making our workday more efficient, which translates to better patient care. Where there is a need to try and tailor the uh, exams in such a way we can get them quick, we can get them even in patients who are actually moving around who we may not be able to sedate, but we are getting good quality diagnostic images so we are getting the relevant information. Pursuing excellence in routine scanning translates into real value uh, for the different stakeholders in different ways. If you're a patient, it matters because your exam is shorter. If you're an image reader or a neuroradiologist, it matters because you get consistent, high-quality images from which you can make decisions on. The technology, obviously, is of paramount importance. And as we all know, that the reimbursements have been changing over the years. So we need something not only cost-effective, we need speed. And that speed is of paramount importance for freestanding neurological or neuroscience institutes. To understand why some patients have prolonged symptoms of concussion, where in fact they may have structural abnormalities in the brain that have not been seen on routine anatomic imaging. That's where the future is. That's where Philips is taking us.